We'll get into him later, but hopping into it, we got Kuma, uh, Akuma, and Zane. Bowser, Duck Hunt on PS2. This is going to be something. Yeah, I, I think already, you know, it's kind of the, the Bowser versus, like, projectile character tail where Bowser's going to get combo to get to, like, 90% Infinity. and then kill them at 2. Dude, you, know? you see this? Holy. <laughs> All right, so apparently Zane is a freaking beast because that was insane. It's so crazy because this seems like the type of character where, like, we, we already know Zane is super into in, inquisitive, where they want to know everything about the game. Uh, and Bowser's like that kind of character where it's easy to know things on him because he's Bowser. He's like the combo character. Mm -hmm. And from Akuma's point of view, they probably don't have too much experience for Duck Hunt. I mean, who does? Yeah, I, I, I am terrified to fight Zane because I have not fought them in bracket before, and I do not know what to do. They are Duck scary. Hunt. They will look, they will look at you in the eyes, shake your hands, tell you BGs. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, Akuma keeping it pretty close though. He is playing Bowser, like you said. Gonna be able to live until large percents, but not past 200. Zane's gonna find that F throw can. That was gorgeous. Yeah, and it is scary because Duck Hunt is one of those characters that, like you said, can get you like to like like 160 potentially, and yeah. Bowser at 160 can kill you different at any character. moment. Yeah. Literally different character. We, we don't really talk about that enough in the fact where Rage influences the game in ungodly ways. Aaliyah or Akuma gonna find that F to that ledge here. But yeah, it's like Bowser's a different character with Rage, Duck Hunt 2. Oh my goodness oh my gracious. God. What the <laughs> hell is that? That is a... Uh, that's gotta be... I wonder if there's something Akuma can do about that, but it Probably did not, not seem like it. Clip it, rewind it, tag Zane on Twitter. I mean, we're, we're probably about to see the same combo back to back. Already at 83. Yeah, and it's so important you have confirms like that against Bowser, like down pack, because you don't want to give this you character don't anything. Just, yeah, and so, but sometimes stuff sucks. sucks, so. All right, yeah, no back air. I think back air would have done it. Yeah, there, I do think back air would have done it. <laughs> but regardless, this is looking rough. Yeah. This might be a next, but anyways, all right. Oh, the yeah. grab. There we go. There we go. It's it's, it's weird because Smash <laughs> is a game where you can take all the damage and it won't matter until the stock is gone. But yeah. It's gonna be a matter of if Akuma can get this stock right now, just close it out. Then maybe we would have seen something possible, but Zane's basically. Yeah, that's here. the thing. I I saw Akuma went for like an F smash earlier because I think Akuma knew like, Desperate. oh, if I take this, then there's it's a chance. Even. <laughs> but but yeah, not never got it. And here we go. F throw can. Gorgeous. That's a. It's not a true combo, but it's definitely a combo Zane has practiced over and over and over yeah. again. Yeah. So they're not gonna drop that one. Uh, pop it into game two. I mean, I don't know much about Akuma. I'll be honest. Maybe, maybe has a you know another. Character like deep this, in the pockets. This is, I think four side Bs. One, two, three, four. And it's into the downer oh, here, right? Is it, yeah, this is, is just a true combo. Yeah. Wow, not even a. <laughs> you see Bowser's face? Yeah. <laughs> that is so funny. And yeah. Aku Akuma. Oh, okay. Total, here we go. total switch here in we play go. style. Yeah, this going is... to Wii Fit Trainer. <laughs> <laughs> this should be interesting. Uh, you know, New York has the most prominent campy Wii Fit on Earth. A lot of the other Wii Fits, they don't really play like John. They like to, you know, take a deep breath and then mash buttons. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. Um, another good Wii Fit, uh, Louis Jesus, Shout definitely Louis. plays a lot more aggressive than John Numbers for sure. Yeah. Likes to do like close-up stuff with deep breathing. And it's really interesting because you get the dichotomy of like both the character play styles where, you know, John will just straight up camp you, but Louis will just straight up mash on you. I think from Akuma, we're probably going to see a little bit more of the latter in terms of just him like opting to, you know, you know, look for the mash, be like, okay, I want to take a deep breath, runs away and does it. Yeah, but it's scary because we saw how good Zane's punish game is. So if you're all like not on point with your mashing, with your aggression, yes, you're going to get literally blown up. Blown up, yeah. And that's something like Wii Fit is not really talked about too much, where this character just, you know, solid damage output, solid confirms that ledge, good ledge trapping, and wow, Zane placing the Kunmin there, so it just drifts down a little bit yeah, and covers that all really that low clean. space that Wii Fit loves so much. Finding that up to that ledge, so good. That's so cool. Zane just knows everything about this character. Yeah, <laughs> it, it's it's like shows how far like it improves them because yeah, they're, if you know everything about your character, you're able to just not miss a beat. It shows how important solo meaning is, and we saw how Akuma switched from Bowser to Wii Fit, but the Wii Fit is putting in much more dividend here. 
in terms of like personally right you can disagree with me on this but i feel like if someone wants to improve and they genuinely mean it they will solo main mm -hmm. yeah i mean that's kind of how um, i've been doing the game for a while like, Ooh, zane looking for the double discus here we go no down smash that ledge maybe another one nope back to nooch and right here, it's like, we fit. It's tough. How are you going to get this kill, you know? Because Zane's setting up these gunmen, yeah. setting up these cans to totally stuff it, out the projectiles. So you got to get close. It's hard when Zane's positioning is just so good. Ooh. Did you see that crawl? Are yeah, you kidding but that, me? that was an unfortunate trade right there for Zane. Not yet. De definitely unfortunate. Oh, it was. I actually thought, I actually thought Zane, uh, Akuma lost a stock there. No. <laughs> yeah. So, okay, here we go. And uh, Akuma just going to go right back to the game plan that oh, works. Oh, is that it? Not going to find the backer there. Nope. Ooh, that was so risky. I don't know what Leah's gonna do here. I mean, it's a little difficult to play versus Duck Knight Ledge because they have so many traps. There we go. But yeah, evening it right back up here, I mean. Yeah, this is not too bad of a deficit right now. No, not at all. It's just a matter of Zane, you know, reverting back to the basic game plan. Oh. Seems to be getting a little bit antsy over here, I mean. We do know that Zane has been playing this game for a while, so they are, you know, comfortable playing with these intense situations. But any bracket you can, you can get nervous, and we think can just do that. Yeah, I, I think though Zane, like they know they're like placed in bracket. They know that they're going to exactly. be winning their like round one. They proved one. themselves before, like they, like you said, they they've done it again and again. Oh, oh my that was God. almost so cool. <laughs> that was so clean. <laughs> And these confirms are hype. Like, this is a lot of stuff not many people know Duck Hunt has, but they do. Yeah, and this being presumably Akuma's secondary. Oh. 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 Bow! Pop smoked him. I think, yeah. 2 0. That was a clean 2 0. And like I was saying, that being presumably Akuma's secondary, I think you just saw the difference in character knowledge being displayed Absolutely. that game. Absolutely. Zane just knew exactly what to do in every spot, and Listen, I feel like Akuma was trying to piece it together. Zane, Zane knew how they wanted to. Com or rather, they knew how to combo Bowser. <laughs> Forced a switch, like quite literally. <laughs> we see uh, some clips here where Zane finds the disc into, uh, what does he find here? To the can, because he knew, or excuse me, they knew that uh, Akuma wanted to pull soccer ball there. So really interesting. I think Zane is just a really good player at calling out your, your how do I say, like your, your positioning. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? You gotta be a stuff hunt, really, because yeah. of how vital can is.